Hey guys, Features Gaming here and welcome back to another video here on the channel and today we are back on Bus Simulator 18 with another episode of the Fetch Assistance Season 2 series and today we are on episode 24 today and we are going to do this route right here which is basically all of the stops in our entire uh, company, our entire thing that aren't level 3 which is what we need to complete this to the C objective so let's select this route right here Go into the MEN wherever it is because we like driving the MEN. Still have the Coca-Cola skin because I don't have my Fresh Citizen skin on yet. I'll talk about that, why I, why it's not in the game yet uh, when we get into the route. So let's start trip and get in there. So let's spawn in. I uh, can't actually remember where we start. Plus undergoing maintenance. I'm going to abort the trip straight away because I actually need to go on to all of these stops. I can't really deal with that right now. As this is such, uh, you know, an important route that we need to pick up all of these stops. So, let's just start the route there real quick. There we go. Let's open the door. Nice. And close it. Okay. Force feedback is off. Which I guess is both good and bad. Turn the engine on. Release the parking brake. And off we go. So the reason why the Fresh Citizens skin isn't in the game yet is because, let me just get the reverse thing off, is because I have not got a clue how to use the Unreal Engine. Now if you don't know, you need the Unreal Engine to mod the game effectively, or mod this game. Not every game, but this game you do need the Unreal Engine. And oh, okay, I'm just going to go. I forgot that they, these brakes weren't the best. So you see you're a truck. Um, so yeah, you do need the Unreal Engine to mod this game. And there's a modding kit that I need to get, but I don't know how to get it. So... You also need to do a few, a few other things in Unreal Engine as well, which again, I have no idea how to do. I'm trying to follow a tutorial, but I have no idea how to do it. So I've created the skin, like I know roughly how it's going to look like um i have also made it so there's another thing that we can that i've added that i'm at, that, bleh, that i'm going to add into the mod if the thing isn't correct so there's also that as well there's just one major thing that won't be on this skin that may be on the other one basically that's just what it is so hopefully it will consist of a skin and a decal this mod hopefully but yeah, I just need to get it, I just need to put it into Unreal Engine because as I said, I have no idea how to use it. And with the modding kit as well, I have no idea how to get that. The Bus Simulator modding kit. So if anyone does know how to get that, then please do let me know in the comments below. And then hopefully the skin will be in the game sooner than later. Because I am trying to get my stepdad to help me with it as well because, you know, he is a programmer. He knows what he's doing, but obviously he is quite busy at the moment, so... Yeah, it's not just a case of asking him how to do it and, you know, he can show me how to do it. It will take time to do. Next stop, Alley. But anyway, oh my god, I keep forgetting how, you know, how these brakes are. I'm it's thinking really about getting a dog. Really? Get a dog then? Well, I imagine it would be awesome. Though I know the work. You guys know how I feel about dogs in houses from my streams if you've been on them. You do know. However, if I got a dog, it might be a lot different. But I'm more of a cat person myself normally. Even though puppies and stuff are super, super cute, so are cats. But cats really never really you know, lose their cuteness, if you see what I mean. They're always cute, 100%. 24-7. Unless you get the wrong breed of cats. Do cats have breeds? I don't know. I know dogs have breeds, but I'm not really sure about cat breeds. You really need to see the view down at the heart. And I don't mean the chocolate company. I mean, I mean cat breeds, not cat breeds. Although I do love Cadbury's chocolate. Next stop, <laughs> High Road. 
delicious. And there we go, there's a bit of the Cadbury's purple there, so there we go. Now I am starving, even though, as I'm recording this video, I had another one of my Cadbury Easter eggs. <laughs> I still haven't gone through all of them yet. Next stop, Grange. Okay, so I think we're going now to a stop where we haven't picked up a single stop for yet, so be able to pick that up for the first time today. Hopefully soon as well we'll be able to change the whole fleet of Sitaro case to one of the buses as well. I don't know whether to get them all CNG buses or MAM buses or whatever makeup bus. I actually don't know which one to get because I think sooner or later we do need to start thinking about getting different buses. I am thinking maybe getting them a CNG bus. Then again, we do kind of need a few bendy buses. But the reason why I don't really like the bendy buses all that much is because there are certain stops that you can't take the bendy bus to. So I'm just thinking of just going with, you know, single uh, units like this and not going with bendy buses. I mean, you know, like for special episodes, then I might get bendy buses because, you know, like we can always get them you know, when we get later on in the series and then do whatever with them later. Just put them on a route where I know that you don't need a bendy bus for. Because if we're going to be earning, like, insane money later on down the line, then we really don't need to, you know, like, get buses to earn us more money. Like, we can just spend money on something and then never use it again. It really doesn't matter and we can always sell it later. That is my thinking, so... I might just go with single units for the rest of the series, but then if we do need to get bendy buses for like a, you know, for like a, um, Next stop, Steinek Chapel. for a Very objective, Thank you. then we can, but then we can just sell the buses later or keep them in the fleet if we ever need them again. So what I might try and do is upgrade the... We'll keep putting drivers on the stops, or keep putting drivers on the... Okay, get off then. As I was talking... Oh, uh, what was I talking about? Um, yeah, just going with single units for the rest of the series. And then if we need bendy buses, then we can always sell them later. So what I might do is... Upgrade the route. Well, not really upgrade it, but like put more drivers on the route that we have the well, most of the stops on, which was that um, route that we had all of the stations in, or all of the state, uh, all of the stops, and just keep putting drivers Feels on that like with buses, the whole night and then hopefully, the if we keep I'm doing so that, excited. then we'll be able to keep putting people on there or drivers on there. So then, no matter what my Next other drivers, uh, you know, what, what else the other routes earn, they'll also, they'll always bring in that money, if you see what I mean. That is my plan. But anyway, I see just left behind, what are you, what? Yesterday I bought some shampoo. Uh-huh. There was... There was no one at the at the stop. I literally stopped there and waited. I hope that's not going to affect the objective. Hopefully, we should get level three on these stops anyway. Dynec East, last stop. Please leave the bus. 
there we go so let's go and do that open the doors and let's get a thumbnail if i can even move out of the bus so let's probably go with you know, like this sort of again there we go see you guys right i think i might just drop this off at the the depot real quick shouldn't take too long i think the depot is like actually i think this is the industry center one isn't it oh well, it shouldn't take us too long i mean we haven't been recording for that long anyway so oh okay Got a train incoming. I'm glad I did do this then. Is it coming through the tunnel? I think that, oh, there it is. Yeah, I, I thought that these ones come through the tunnel. Nice locomotive there. Is it going to be a double one or are we going to let go? Oh my god, these barriers take ages. Oh my god, we're going up with the barrier. <laughs> Am I really still on the barrier? That was weird. Right, let's go to drive, please. Thank you. Those barriers take ages, man. I started lifting up on it as well. I think it, like, caught my mirror or something. And it just, like, lifted me up, even though we didn't even see it. But you know what physics are like in this game. If it was real, I think that's what would have happened. Should have rephrased that sentence a bit more. So we've got a train. There you go. You train guys are going to like this video then. Even though many of you are just going to skip this video and not even watch it anyway. But there you go. Slow down, 50. Why did you just stay in the middle of the road? I guess the um, good thing as well with this as well is... Um, we don't have to slow down for speed bumps and potholes, actually, even though I'm going to do it anyway. Well, I might not do it with speed bumps, but definitely for potholes and stuff, because I think you can still cause damage on the potholes, but I don't think you can really with the speed bumps, or I don't really know. I've not really uh, tested that out. So as you can see, we just went through that pothole and we didn't get any sort of, you know, like, uh, hit a pothole because there's no passengers on my bus to complain about it. So I guess this game really only minds if there's passengers on the, on the bus that, you know, you're going to upset by doing stuff like that. I'm glad that it's based off that and not even caring about the driver or the bus. It's all about caring about the passengers, which I guess is, you know, what it's like in real life. But obviously, in real life, they protect the bus and the actual driver themselves. But in this game, it just seems like they only care about the passengers, and that's about it. We just mind about getting them to their destination on time. Right, stuck in a bit of traffic to get to our depot. I mean, I could just uh, go on the wrong side of the road and just get past them like I have been doing in previous episodes, which many of you guys are just probably thinking, why haven't you done that in this episode? I want this episode to be a little bit chilled out, to be honest, like not all, like not constantly causing, you know, like, you know, trying to be a rally car driver, if you see what I mean, which is probably what makes this series fun, but I think now I'm actually going to do it at all. Can I? No. Right, it's just this purple truck anyway, so yeah, I think we just stick behind. Why are you staying? But come on, let's go. We literally had you to go. Why aren't you going, man? Go. Why? Why did he not go? He had time before those came down. Thank you. That was so weird. Oh, don't you dare me. <laughs> Well, I guess thank you for getting on with it. Right, this should be a five-star journey. No, actually, it won't be because we have the uh, passengers left behind thing, which I really still don't get. Why did that happen? I just realised I did this entire route without lights on either. Right, there we go. So let's stop. Lights off. 
double check for rubbish as well because there might be someone who's left some rubbish on the bus. Although I think it's actually clear. So our passengers have actually behaved themselves and taken their rubbish with them. So let's disembark the bus, close the doors, and there we go. Um, uh, okay. Do we need to... Oh, that's why we didn't turn off the engine, that's why. <laughs> I was wondering why it didn't, um... Why didn't activate? I swear I forgot to switch off the engine. Alright, cool. So... Oh, run a red light. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I mean, it's, it's, it's still okay, I guess. Uh, level 16 now as well, which is cool. Oh my god, Steinek Chapel is not on level 3 yet. How is it not on level 3? What is going on with that? But look at that, 356,000 euros. What what bus can we even get with that now? Like, we're on 448,000 euros. That's enough to get a... To, like, get into the Setra, isn't it? Level 18 and we unlock. Ah, oh, no, it's this one. No, I don't like this one. But yeah, I might think about getting some CNGs. Because these are 330,000 euros. And we do need to start, you know, putting drivers on this. So I'm going to get a CNG. I'm going to customise it with the Coca-Cola ad. Just like so. Apply. Yes. I'm going to get a driver. And I'm going to put this on the all the stations one thing in my jig. So let's go and put them on that. There they go. And now that route should be earning around about 200,000 euro a week, which should be brilliant. So we haven't done the journey yet. Um, I mean, I could, I mean, I guess I could, I could just forego and just do it in this episode, make this episode quite long. Uh, it's this one. So we, if we edit this route real quick. If we just delete these and we just do these three stations quickly, our route needs to have at least four stops. No! Okay, if we do that like that, okay, hold on. If we just do this, just drive that real quick in this episode. But then that's gonna, that's gonna do the things wrong. Oh man, what do I do? Okay, uh, <laughs> How do I do this? I don't know. Um, I really don't know what to do. Um, what do I do? Because I need to do this one. I mean, I guess the next objective is going to be big anyway, because I think it's going to unlock the, the old town. And we're going to then need to start creating loads of different routes and stuff. So I think in the next episode, it will involve a lot of admin. So I might do this quick job in the next episode and then do the admin. And then I think we'll do it there. So and then I'll keep the the reason, the reason why is because I just want to keep the episodes and the week numbers synced up. So, yeah, that's going to be it for today, then, I guess. So thank you for watching this video. If you did, then leave a like on it. That'd be awesome. And thank you very much. Also, make sure to subscribe as well if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys in the next video. I'll stream it until then. Take care and... Peace out.